Why does Donald Trump appeal to voters? One word, fear. Research shows that conservatives tend to respond to messages that evoke fear. And Donald Trump understands this better than anyone. When Trump says things like, I think Islam hates us. When Mexico sends its people, they're bringing drugs, they're bringing crime, they're rapists. President Obama, he is the founder of ISIS. He's the founder of ISIS, okay? His fear-inducing messages are more salient and heard louder. You might think that the extreme loyalty of Trump supporters is pretty surprising until you consider the science behind it. Then it almost starts to seem predictable. For example, a 2008 study published in the journal Science found that compared to liberals, conservatives have a stronger physiological response to threatening images and startling noises. While a 2011 brain imaging study found that conservatives tend to have a larger amygdala, a brain structure that's electrically active during states of anxiety and fear. And the 2014 fMRI study found that the conservative brain lights up more strongly in response to disturbing images. Something bad is happening, and we can't be the stupid ones. When you have ISIS and others that want to blow up our country. Our country has to toughen up, folks. So how does Trump play into the hypersensitivity to threat among the American public? There's an influential psychology theory called care management theory. The theory says that when we're reminded of our own mortality, we do things to preserve our cultural worldviews. Events like terror attacks already remind us of our mortality, but Trump puts extra effort into making these events more salient in the American psyche. Donald J. Trump is calling for a total and complete shutdown of Muslims entering the United States. And we have to start by building a wall, a big, beautiful, powerful wall. Our country's going to hell. He seems to intuitively know that fueling existential fear makes his supporters more loyal. I could stand in the middle of Fifth Avenue and shoot somebody and I wouldn't lose any voters, okay? It's like incredible. Fear-mongering is Donald Trump's way of leveraging terror management theory to his advantage and in effect promote a tribal mentality that can influence elections. Fear keeps Trump's followers energized and focused on safety. And when you think you've found your protector, you become more tolerant of offensive remarks and unstable behavior.